My name is Puneet Ballab and today I am going to show you a demonstration how you can change your ID or SATA interface to USB interface. As uh, you all know that nowadays most of the devices are USB devices or having a USB interface like all the uh, desktops laptops and tablets even your car, car audio is having USB interface so how I can change ID or SATA interface to USB interface it is very easy so let us see the demonstration of how we can change our ID or SATA devices into USB, USB device from which we can change our ID or SATA interface to USB interface. It comes with an adapter and here is a device. See, one side is of SATA interface and the other side is USB interface this is power cable to give power to your SATA device now I will show you how you can change this SATA DVD drive into USB interface like you, are, you can see this these are SATA interface this is DVD drive and first of all I will plug this power port to this DVD drive like this and this is a data cable this will go to this DVD drive like this now the power and data cable is inserted in those, into this DVD drive and just put this USB cable to your laptop, desktop or any other device and this adapter is going to provide power to this device. Likewise you can use this device with this laptop hard disk this is also a SATA hard disk you can use with this desktop hard disk also this is also a SATA hard disk it is very useful in the times when you have to recover some data from your hard disk like your OS has been crashed and you want data out of your hard disk then you can use this cable it is very useful and multi-purpose cable this is IDE hard disk as you can see here this is IDE port so you can insert this card to this IDE port like this and give it power with your SMPS insert power cable and now this ID hard disk has been converted to USB so as you have seen that very easily we can convert all these devices into USB devices it is also very useful for the laptops the mini laptops which don't have CD drive or DVD drive like this laptop has no CD or DVD drive but 
I always install operating system or some software with the help of this cable with the help of this USB cable and this DVD drive so it is very useful device and it is very easy to use I feel this information will help you out in your day to day problems and thanks for watching this video and we will be meeting soon with some another cool stuff